Today I want to give you three great books to read in 2018. My name is Amelia Sims. This is Reinventing You, the vlog where you can follow me as I go on my reinventing journey. I post twice a week on Sundays and Tuesdays, and of course you can tune in at any time. And I invite you to share this vlog with those that you think might be interested. And if you haven't yet, don't forget to subscribe. Today I want to share three books that right now are having a great impact on me and my reinventing journey. The first book was actually a commencement address by Admiral William H. McRaven, and he gave it, I think, a couple years ago at the University of Texas at Austin, and he talked about in the speech how you can change the world just by changing yourself. And one of the main things or the basic things that you can do is to start each day doing the little things like making your bed. So the name of the book is Make Your Bed by William H. McRaven. I liked the book because it just gave some of the simple things that you can do to change your life. He also gives some great stories, and so I highly recommend Make Your Bed. The second book that I recommend and that really impacted me is actually a children's book. It's called Way of the Warrior Kid, and it's by Jocko Willink. He's a former Navy SEAL, and the illustrator is John Bozak. Yes, it is a children's book, but anybody of any age can read it. And I also have a link talking about the book um, as well, so you can follow that. One of the things that I liked about the book is that in the story, um, the little kid named Mark, who's in fifth grade, he has an awful year in fifth grade. He's been bullied. He's unable to physically do things like push pull-ups and he also can't remember his timetables he's having a really hard time but his uncle Jake is coming to see him for the summer and he's real excited his uncle Jake is a retired Navy SEAL and uncle Jake kind of helps Mark realize his own potential and become a warrior kid I really like the basic things that Mark learns to do like get a good night's sleep eat well exercise, in fact, begin the day with exercise, learn things, in fact, learn how to learn. <laughs> Studying is such a big part of being a warrior kid or warrior anything. Getting some um, self-confidence, learning a new skill, and knowing that in order to defend yourself, you don't have to be bigger or gruffer or meaner, you just have to have some knowledge and some skills. And on top of all of this is to have a code of action, a code of behavior, how you act in the world. And it reminds me of my own rules that I also like to follow. And one of the really nice things about this book, it talks about plateauing, especially when it comes to exercise, where you get to a certain point where you can't push any further. Or maybe you've discovered this if you've ever tried to lose weight and you lose so many pounds and then you just kind of get stuck. Plateauing has really been an issue for me right now in my reinventing journey. I'm not working, but I haven't been not working long enough to really get used to it. So I'm still floundering around how to best use my time. What do I need to do next? And so that was just really helpful. So even though it's a children's book, I recommend it for adults as well. Way of the Warrior Kid. The last book is Sleep Smarter by Sean Stevenson. In Sleep Smarter, Sean Stevenson provides 21 ways in order not to sleep more or sleep better, but sleep smarter. Some of them were really helpful. Some of them sort of like, oh, I already knew that. But some of them are like, really? And I, I love the way Sean writes and presents not just an idea, but he gives background, he gives scientific facts, he quotes journals. So it's not like you just say, oh, this really worked for me, but this works for other people as well. And I also like the way the book ends with a 14 day sleep makeover, which I will be attempting that very shortly. But I have read the book and applied some of the things that I learned already. I think that this book is gonna have more impact on my life as I continue on my reinventioning journey, that sleep smarter, I hope that one or more of these books will be helpful to you. Maybe you can add them into your to-be-read list. As I said, these are some of the ones in 2018 that have impacted me, and I hope that they help you as well. Please share this video with anyone you think might be interested in reading more or about the reinventioning journey that I'm going through. My name is Amelia Sim. This is Reinventing You. Can't wait to see you on the next post. Have a great one.